What's going on guys? Welcome to another video and in this video I'm going to tell you how much JavaScript you need to know to get your first job. Alright, so first of all let me just tell you that this is purely based upon my own experience and from my opinion and the opinion of other senior developers and managers that I have met through all my development career. So the point number one that I would like to mention that you really need to know is uh, data types, okay? Once you're gonna get into your first job, you really need to know your data types in JavaScript. You need to know what's the difference between a string, a number, a race, objects. You need to really know the difference between them and when to use them in the right times, okay? So this is something really, really important. The point number two is you need to know functions all right guys so this is really really important because you use functions everywhere in javascript okay it's going to help you like reduce the code that you are writing it's going to keep you if you remember that uh, principle dry don't repeat yourself this is basically what functions is all about they help you keep your code organized and really reduce a lot of code so you need to know basically how to build a function when to call it so this is really another point that you have to know to get your first job. And finally, another point, this is just like three points that I, I, I want to make. The final point is really, uh, you need to know how to make a click event, okay? It can be a click event, it can be um, a hover event, something like you are actually just like interacting with a page. You want to click on something, let's make for, for, for example, if you're going to op click on a button and it's going to open a modal window and then for example if you want to click on an X or something to close it, you need to know how to make this kind of a click function, this click event. Uh, because you are going to use it in so many different websites and projects that you really need to know these kind of things when you get into your first job, okay? So uh, this was just like some of the points that I wanted to mention because a lot of you guys have been asking me like how much JavaScript you actually need to know before you get into your first job. But the thing is guys, you don't actually need to know a lot. Some of you guys think that, oh my God, I need to, to know this, that, 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 that. And you just need to know the basics. And this is like what, what I've just mentioned in this video. If you know these kind of things, you will, you, you will actually learn a lot more in the actual job. When you are going to be in the job itself, that you are going to be building projects, you are going to be work side by side with the senior developers and your managers. They will help you and they will teach you a lot of things and your experience like this is going gonna, is gonna to improve much more rather than you are being at home. This is almost like you are getting paid to learn, okay? Um, so really, that, that's it guys, uh, just remember as well that uh, maybe nowadays, because web, web developers, they are in, in a huge demand at the moment, okay, everywhere in the world. Uh, look at this, for example, my previous company, ActiveWin, where, where, where I was working before, they were just giving a £1,000 bonus reference to anyone who would reference another developer to take my, my position. And this is not just in my previous company. There is like loads of different companies doing these kind of things. So 1,000 pounds is like $1,200 maybe. So can you see how important this is? So um, this, is, this is just like a bit everywhere. Web developers are in a huge demand, but there is also a lot of uh, young developers, like people who, who want to, to get into this industry. So there is a lot more competition nowadays. So uh, that's why there is a lot of companies requiring not just like the basics of JavaScript. So probably you will, you will have to know other than just like JavaScript, you will need to know as well a little bit more another library, for example, like React or Angular. It doesn't mean that you actually need to know them because there is still a lot of companies out there who will just hire. If you know the basics of JavaScript, then you can learn React or Angular in the company itself. 
but it's all always good nowadays to be a little bit one step forward you know so you you are a little bit more prepared and you know a little bit more than your competition this is important guys because if you guys are not putting in the work there is going to be another guy another two guys another three guys that they are really hungry to get a job you know they they really have the motivation to get a job and to change their life to to get a better salary, to improve their life, and they will put in the work to know more than you. So you have to put in the work as well, okay? So that's it, that's it for this video, guys. Uh, I want to keep it short, just, just to let you know that I'm back now for my holidays, like I said, and I want to be doing a lot more uh, videos now, <laughs> a lot more content coming up, so hopefully you guys will stay tuned for this, and please give me a thumbs up if you like this video, and subscribe to the channel if this is your first video and I'll see you in the next video.